good morning everybody long time no see so i'm coming here with the twin six month update i just got a second um they were just screaming their heads off both of them so i gave them their bottle early and they are in the swing and hopefully they will go to sleep so um let's just get started sorry about my hair but i just had this little two little braids in this ponytail but this is what you guys are going to get today. I was hoping to be together, but it has been a crazy day. I had to go to the airport, get my first son from the airport, and I think that just went through the twins off. So they have been cranky all morning. So let's get started. Um, at six months, Hudson was 17 pounds and two ounces, 26 inches and three fourths long. Harlow was 11 pounds and 10 ounces, 25 inches and 3 fourths long. So he is bigger than her, which we already knew. Um. Okay, guys, sorry about that. My husband was calling. Now I know you hear the music and the TV in the background, but the babies are up. They never were asleep. They were just taking their bottles but they are over there in their swings I don't know if you guys can see them there's Hudson looking hey man hey hi man what are you doing hey there he is in his swing and then there Harlow is and her so, the music you hear is their swings. Okay, so starting this again for the third time. So, where was I? Um, Hudson. Oh, yes, he's bigger. Um, they are sitting up now. So, that's good. Um, I also have talking points on my phone. So, if I'm looking down, that's what... Um, doing um they are rolling over uh harlow rolls over like crazy then she started this in like five months four or five months five months one day she was on the floor on her activity center and i just watched her she just went back to her back back to her stomach back to her back back to her and she did this for like an hour until eventually she just started rolling 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 and now she just rolls everywhere hudson can roll over but he's just kind of I'll roll over and then I'm done. Hey, what are you talking about over there? What are you talking about over there? Why are you making all that noise? Why are mommy baby making that noise? Yeah. So, um, he rolls over too, but just not as actively as she does. She, um, they are going crazy over here, y'all. Now you see why I cannot make a video. Um, I wanted to start trying to make videos more regularly. Um, please let me know if you guys want to see that. I don't know exactly like what my channel would be about. I guess it's pretty much like dating stuff. Um, a lot of, you know, my little, I don't know, maybe craft stuff I do. I do a lot of DIY craft stuff and at home and all my friends and family love it. But I don't know if you guys, and then definitely stuff with the babies, but let me know in the comments if you guys want to see more videos from me. I know it's like uh, far and few in between the videos that I make. Uh, like I said, the babies keep me super busy. So I'm just trying. They're getting older now. Like I said, they're six months. Um, this video is a little late. They will be seven months on the 8th of December. So we're almost a month late. But they are on a schedule now. So they are getting better. It's not as bad. But we do still have, you know, our bad days. And uh, so we're just trying to get better. So hopefully the older they get, the better they get. And I'll be able to do that. Okay, what else? Oh, the babies laugh. Yeah, they laugh and act crazy. They think everything is so funny. When nothing is funny, it's crazy. They think everything is so funny. They don't like it when I sneeze or when I blow my nose. They look at me crazy like, what is this lady doing? It's hilarious. Um, we thought Harlow was teething. 
we've seen something there but now it went away so i don't know what is going on um they both keep their fingers in their mouth and they are drooling like crazy hey hey mamas what's going on what's the matter what is the matter with my baby what is the matter with my baby hey mamas what mamas see how she keeps her fingers in her mouth they keep in here all the time what are you over there doing okay excuse the mess you guys there he is Hey, hey, fat man. Hey. See, they're just so spinny all the time. Anyways, okay, so um, that's it. We think that they're teething. Um, what else? I'm sitting in my bed, you guys. Uh, usually I would be downstairs, but when they started acting crazy, they were really fussy, so I brought them upstairs to get in their swing to hopefully go to sleep. And yeah, that didn't work. They're wide awake, but they're not really fussing anymore. So, um, they have walkers, so they're in their walkers. Uh, Hudson can push his around really good and get to where he's trying to go. Harlo, she pushes hers around, but I don't think she quite has the hang of trying to push it to where she's trying to go to. So. You know she's a lot lighter than him so i think the the weight helps him because you know he can go any direction but she'll get it she'll get it um they're still spitting up a lot like crazy actually you know what the last couple of days it slowed down but up until then after every meal all through the day they're spitting up i'm changing them constantly all day changing their clothes changing their bibs they're just like and it's full on like throw up they just spit up like whatever they drink if it seems like that whole bottle comes up or it's um curdled milk so whatever they didn't digest so we have an appointment to see the gi specialist um they didn't have any appointments till january so our appointment is on the 15th so we're going to see if everything is okay and what's going on the doctor says she doesn't really want to worry about it because they were preemies that a lot of babies have that anyway and then with them being preemies they might just have it a little longer than what normal babies were um, besides that she said that hey hey what are you doing why are you screaming you're only over here screaming <sighs> see this is what i go through hey 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 calm down you calm down so um, I'm going to try to get through this video so you guys are going to hear them cry. Because if I don't, I'll never get this done. So um, that's about it. We did. We started sleep training at five months. So they are in their cribs, in their rooms. Um, they pretty much sleep through the night. They make up, wake up about once or twice. They just want their pacifier and they go back to sleep. Um, Harlow's really good at it. She'll take her pacifier and roll right back over Hudson. You have to calm down a little bit more. And a lot of the times, uh, he, we have to get him and take him out of the room so he won't wake her up. So, I think he's just spoiled and he realizes that. So, this is what he does. But, I don't know. We'll see. We keep at it. Um, they're also on a schedule in the daytime um, that I got from that book, uh, the baby whisper so that really helped we wake up in the morning we play uh we eat play some more then we sleep we wake up eat play bath and then sleep um they are eating food now um solid twice a day now breakfast and dinner they um very good healthy appetites they would much rather eat the food than drink the bottles at this point um, the doctor said it was okay i was only feeding them once a day and uh which was dinner and she told me to go ahead and bump it up to twice a day because they 
do they are so interested in food anything that you eat they're like in your face they're grabbing for it they want your plate um just everything so that's what they're doing so they get five ounce bottles um and then they eat i make their baby food so we're doing pretty good um right now it's not really pureed pureed anymore they want something with a little more thickness to it substance to it uh the pureed stuff now they just get mad at it and spit it out so that's good um as looking down at my phone guys i had it, my talking point um as for me postpartum um i'm doing good uh, I've completely lost all of the weight plus extra 20 pounds, so I'm down 40 pounds at right now. Um, extra 20 pounds is probably all of the weight I gained taking all the medicine before I got pregnant, trying to get pregnant. So I lost that. Um, my goal is to lose another 10 pounds. If I do, it's great. If I don't, that's fine. Um, my stomach is down. It's not like a six pack or anything, but it's not hanging or juicy or anything. The only thing that I don't like are, are my love handles and the sides. I, I can't stand at it for some reason. I can't get rid of it, so I need to figure out how to do that. Um, I'm also going to be having surgery this month. I'm going in for a breast reduction. Yay! I'm so excited. Um, they were already big, and then getting pregnant and having twins and breastfeeding, they became even bigger and I'm, I'm about over it so I'm getting that done at the end of the month um, I also started back to school I started back today actually so that's great I'm going to GCU um, Grand Canyon University so I'm very excited about that and so since I'm home with the babies I might as well finish school and by the time I, I'm finished and I'm ready to you know be done being home or they're old enough so somebody else can watch them I can go back to work to my new um, oh I had very bad um, postpartum shedding my hair broke off so much it's already really thin you guys can see how thin it is and then look at those edges I mean, and I've been cutting and clipping and, and, you know, like, trying to get them together. And it's still, like, I don't know, it's, it still sheds every day. It's so much hair on the floor. Also, I had my edges fell out too really bad, especially on this side, which they're coming back. But, yeah, this side was good. But this side was really bad. I don't know what to do. I don't, I'm just like thinking maybe I should get back on my prenatal pills. Um, I have no idea if any of you guys know a remedy or something I can do to get my hair um, back right again. Please leave a comment. Let me know what did you guys do? What are you guys taking? Um, I'm thinking about that hair affinity. Has anybody taken it? What do you think? Sorry, I'm not looking at the camera. I'm looking at the the finder the viewfinder whatever that thing is view whatever it is reflecting back to me so so I, um i'm about to go so i oh nikki visits so the nikki nurse is supposed to come every three months to visit the baby and just check their growth and health since you know they were preemies um on her last visit they did so well they are doing past their adjusted age. They are actually doing past what a regular full-time baby was doing at that time. They were doing more, so they decided not to have any more visits until they're one, so, which is great. Also, my doctor, you know, concurred that she said if she didn't know they were preemie babies, she wouldn't, I mean, she wouldn't even know. They are doing so great developmentally. They're on point. They're doing everything that they're supposed to be doing. And um, that's it. So, thumbs up this video. Let me know if you want me to do more videos. Um, and I will definitely try to get them in. Alright, bye.